everything from tactics for, for sports like short track to create curriculum for sports uh, based on where athletes are in their pathway. Um, so it's, it's really become a very broad based um, kind of uh, a tool and process that I think is only going to gain more and more strength as we move on. The tactical use of the, of the information has become really important and prevalent. Um, you know, we're seeing now where, you know, short track, they're using it to try and understand, you know, how they can deal with different opponents, curling, the same kind of thing, how they might change their game through, uh, you know, through an early shift in, in certain uh, pieces. So, you know, those kind of analytics um, that will help shape tactics in game and in process, I think will have a big effect as, uh, you know, not only in Korea, but, but beyond. As the saying goes, uh, you know, from, from Moneyball, if you're, if you're not playing in this game, in this space right now, you're, you're going to be left in the dust. A lot of curling over the years has been sort of old wives' tales and, you know, you learn from doing and I think this will speed up the process for a lot of people and it'll, someone can show you your refutable evidence, you're, you're better, you're, it's easier to understand and it's easier to accept and then make changes for the positive. So I think that's, that's probably where it'll, this will take us. It's chess on ice. There's a lot of decision making. There's a lot of pros and cons and if we do this then this happens and you know this leaves the the other player this and you know if analytics can show you you know you might you may really want to make the call a but maybe call b leaves your opposition shot c which he misses all the time so then you've got a better chance to win it's very valuable to us and i mean when we're looking at a, a start which is a four to five second uh, portion of, of our luge run and we're looking for hundreds or even thousands of a second within that start uh, I mean we've, we've relied on a lot of analytics whether it's uh, forced plate handles so j judging what uh, what difference there is between the left side and the right side in our pull and, uh, and measuring that just to make sure that we're as even as possible to create as much velocity straight forward Sure it's definitely helping us to make sure that we have the right condition in place for our athletes, the type of fitness level we want to see from them, the type of performance we want to see from a start perspective. Uh, that type of stuff is really dialed in for Pyeongchang already from analytics. You saw it in baseball, um, you see it in basketball now where the smart teams, the teams that are paying attention to this stuff win. And so everybody starts to do it because in the end it's an athletic competition and people are trying to win.